with doing so many movies, TV, and television, what is your diet regimen? Because I see, you know, I'm, I'm trying to lose weight and get in shape for the ladies. So Absol how do you keep in shape? Absolutely, man. You know, I try to keep things in life pretty simple. You know what I mean? So I just eat really colorful food. I try to stay away from foods that's like white and eat more foods that are red and orange, yellow, green, purple. And then every every day I do 10 minutes of workout every day. Okay. Just right on the floor next to my bed and something that is attainable for anybody. And I don't use any weights, so I don't, no weights. I don't go to the gym. And I don't ever travel to go work out. Like I'll work out right here on the floor with you. you know what I mean, so okay. simple. You know, follow me on Highway Fit. It's my social health never social health initiative to change the way that America and the world sees health, fitness, and nutrition. That's what's up, man. Definitely, that's important to me. I just been three years of meat, no meat. So yeah. you know, I'm trying to get my life right. So I definitely appreciate you dropping that advice. So what you've been doing TV and movies for so long? This is a, a TV one movie. You know, the last interview I did, I talked about how when they shoot motion pictures for movie theaters, they're looking to build a franchise, but generally TV movies is like you get in and you get out. So how, how was it preparing for this role? Uh, I think it's great. I mean, the thing about the franchise thing is that like they're already talking about expanding this now because the work's been so good. Wow. I got a brilliant cast. Uh, the director's fantastic. It's a great subject matter. And I think there's comedy, uh, comedy and life and drama beyond just the script that we have right now. But I feel blessed to be here, and, and you know, I've been knocking it out every day, and I take this very seriously, and I love what I do, and um, I'm not going to stop. Okay. So if you can give an actor, like, three tips when coming to a set or working with a, a producer or a director, what would you tell them? Uh, first thing i say is professionalism, right? Um, you guys got to always be a professional. And no matter what arena you work in, whether you're a flight attendant or a nurse, you know, you have to hold yourself in a way that says, I'm here because I'm a professional. Uh, second thing is treat everybody right. You know, there's a different hierarchy on the totem pole, and sometimes people are, you know, their job might be not as 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 prominent as your job, or sometimes people have more important jobs than you. Treat everyone with respect. And then the the third thing too is just, just focus. You know, like this is America, and we believe in this country. And if you bring focus to your job, you're gonna do a great job, and it's gonna make the whole country better. So that's the three things that I would say. Okay, so we all know it's summertime, it's pilot season, all the networks gearing up for some big shows. So you're working on anything? I know you're always cooking up something. Yeah, man, I'm trying to get on the biggest, best shows, man. I want to play cop, doctor, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I, you know, I just try and do my best, man. I, I train every day. I read about an hour of lines every single day, no matter what. Uh, I take no days off. Uh, I'm up on my fitness, and you know, I do 10 minutes of fitness every day. And uh, this, this business is incredible, man. I love it, and you can change the entire world, you know? So right. it's a great opportunity. So if a kid was looking to break into the business, how would you tell them, you know, with balancing school, right. you know, acting classes, you know, traveling and things of that nature? Yeah, I mean, first thing first is school. School is the most important, man. You learn how to read and arithmetic. That's like hands down the most important thing. But then also like your training, man. You know, I think that I was trained in theater. So I think theater training is a great way to start and get in this business for the right reason, man. If you want to actually be in this craft, fall in love with the craft. Don't fall in love with the results of being a big movie star or having a lot of money or a car or whatever, you know, do it because you love it. And if you, you love something else, then apply yourself to that. Okay. So do you ever see yourself jumping into directing, like producing your own film or starting a production company? Man, I want to stay in front of the camera, man. I mean, ask Denzel Washington that he ain't directing nothing <laughs> either, man. He's been on so many sets. I'm like, yo, DW, when are you going to direct something? Um, but I just, I love